Palantir. Yeah. I'm here to tell you about your history. No. And I have experienced much of it. Dub Dub I have been to many times. I was there at the birthing of this kingdom. What a glorious day. There were such moments in all those times, I could tell you. But you have bards and scholars plenty to tell you of these things. So I'll bring you a North Shield tale from far, far away. Deep, deep to the south. I have noticed of late, at this same location, I have seen more of the North Shield. But this is some seven years ago. So I'm not certain that the contingent at Gulf Wars back then was quite as strong as I might have been. And this, a singular event, at the War Bard Tourney. Now, the War Bard Tourney, no bragging here, has been dominated by Kalantir. <laughs> Fully half of all those who have won have come from Kalantir, and up until this last year, each year we had had the most bardic entrants. But this one year, where are we having this bardic entrance? We're just all sitting in little tent they have set aside, a kind of a green room, if you will. And a certain bard that I knew took his guitar, went up onto the stage and started singing. And when I heard the song, I went, I love this song. And I went outside. And I sang with the chorus, because it's the only part of the song I know. And, well, except for one other line, but we'll get to that later. And then I noticed a few other bards and by the end of his performance, over half of those bards of the known world were singing the chorus to the song that won for the first and only time for Norshi at the War Bard Tourney at Gulf Wars. All for one, one for all, march we now upon the foe. Let no king or low-born armsman stand alone in fields below. We will all charge together and together stand or fall. All for one Griffin soldiers one for all. My favorite line is, let them bring on all their archers. We fight them.